Good evening and welcome to 22 News at 11. If you are someone who has always relied on traditional incandescent light bulbs, there is a new wattage on the retired list. 22 News reporter Julie McDonald standing by live in Springfield after speaking with customers about their lighting preferences. Well, under federal law, as of today, 75 watt incandescent bulbs can no longer be produced or imported, so the government can make way for more energy efficient light sources. If you're an incandescent bulb user who doesn't like change, stock up while you can. The 75 watt bulbs are officially retired as LED and compact fluorescent bulbs are ushered in. One long meadow man told 22 News he's been using CFLs for years, but he does notice a difference in the brightness. Incandescents are better. I mean, the light is better. That's what the light we, we usually got used to. So that CFL lights it. light is not really bright. So <laughs> it's not yellow. It's, it's white lights. Another man told 22 News he'll use incandescents while he still can for that brightness, but he does appreciate what the more energy efficient bulbs mean for his wallet. We have uh, modern lighting in the building I have, and it works well, uses less energy. Electric bill reflects that. For consumers who do prefer to light with incandescent bulbs, even though they're being phased out, you'll still see them on store shelves for a while. There's still plenty of inventory on the 75 and 100 watt light bulbs. So if, if they prefer those light bulbs, they're still out there and we still got plenty of them. And 100 watt incandescents were retired last year, and then the 60 and 40 watt bulbs will be phased out in 2014. Now, you'll pay a little bit more for LED lights up front, but then you won't have to change them for a couple decades. And if you're concerned that the CFLs won't work with your dimming switches, there are specific dimming designs. Just check the package. Live in Springfield tonight, Julie McDonald, 22 News.